there. Bet you've been wondering what I've been up to. You don't have to lie. I know you haven't. Uh, oh, this, you're wondering, you're wondering what I'm drinking. I'm drinking a nice fighting cock and cherry coke. Sitting on my couch contemplating the mere existence of me. We're so little. There's so many stars. So many stars in the sky, you know. So many things to make you feel like a tiny, a tiny ant on the line of existence. Makes you really think life is just, just a smidge pointless. It's pointless, but it's got points at the same time. Don't let it fool you. The pointlessness of existence makes you go, oh, I, c I can do whatever. I can do whatever I want. But there's some things you shouldn't do. We shouldn't go rounds and fisticuffs. You get what I'm saying. Like, why, why are we fighting each other? A man comes in, tells you, hey, you've got fat toes, so you want to fight him. That's not a reason to fight somebody. Maybe, maybe you do got big toes. Maybe he's just making observations, fighting over big toes. What's wrong with you? <laughs> We're all politically correct now. Correcting ourselves in a political fashion not to offend the people. But we need to understand there's a difference between being politically incorrect and <laughs> an asshole. You still know what I'm saying. Look at you. Just, just doing your thing. I'm doing my thing. By thing, I mean. I need to plan better. Make schedules and planning the happenings. But schedules are good. They're really good. Like, if if I have it planned out. It's like painting by numbers. Painting by numbers isn't hard. Who told you that? You got a plan. You just, you fill in, you fill in the color that goes in with the plan. It's that simple. Simple. And sometimes you decide, hey, the, the color that was, that was assigned to that specific area isn't the color I want on there. And you can, you can modify your plans to fit around whatever color you want to use. Not, not telling you how to live your life. You need to tell yourself how to live your life because you know your life better than most, better than some asshole on the internet. I hope my neighbors can't hear my words of inspiration. Actually, I do hope they hear it. Y'all gonna get learned that today. My cat's running. I need to live life like my cat. She goes, hey. I'm on this side of the house, but I want to be on the other side of the house. She doesn't, she doesn't sit and contemplate it. She doesn't go, oh, I'll move to that side of the house like tomorrow. Because she knows if she moves to that side of the house tomorrow, if she says that, she's not going to actually do it. She's still going to be on the other side of the house. She does it right when she thinks it. She gets an idea and she does it. She's on one side of the house, then she moves to the other. No thoughts needed. She just, pff, I need from there to there. She runs. I ran a couple times back in my day. Don't much like running now. But think, thankfully, this is a metaphor. A metaphor for how I should be living.